So now we're going to start installing VIOS machine option in the virtual box. Go to new, call it VIOS dash one. It's not Microsoft Windows, it's other, other unknown. Next, memory size, make it 1024 for one gig. Hard disk is two gig. Next, next, this is good. Now VS1 right here, you have to go to settings. Storage, you're going to select the downloaded VIOS. Choose Add, Download. This is the rolling release that we got, 1.3. Open. And then put it here. 1.3 right here, choose it. So now you got a startup disk. Go to network. Make sure you have first adapter. That's the interface. Put it to in internal. And one advanced option is going to be para virtualized. Adapter to enable. Internal. N2 for now, that are virtualized. So it's got two adapters or two interfaces. Okay. So you got your first one. Let's start it. Over here, you just press enter. And let it start. Once you get the prompt, you log in with the default VIOS, VIOS, show interface, you got two interfaces, you're going to do install image, yes, auto yes. Yes, yes, just keep pressing enter. Enter again. Press the password, BIOS, BIOS, unless you want to change it. You're done. Do power off. Yes. And now VOS one setting again. Storage. Remove the attachment so that it doesn't take the CD for booting up. Start. We'll get you this menu when you start ins after installing it. You go through the boot process. So it boots up, gives you the prompt, VIOS, VIOS. It's up and running, show interface. You got two interfaces. That's how you install VIOS. Power off. Yep.